Warning, this video contains graphic images that may not be suitable for little sissy bitches, so if your discretion is advised, we kill shit here. Trapper J Outdoors is sponsored by Dude Traps, Wildlife Management Equipment, and Dunlap Lures, Results Matter. Well, it's the next day. It's nice out. Shirt weather. It's a little hot for waders and hiking. Yesterday the wind was blowing so hard. I said to heck with it. I was like, I'll just walk back. Go shed hunting. I didn't find any sheds here, but huh? I'm looking at a different spot on the way back. Maybe I'll pick one up. Pretty good jog though. I'm probably a half mile in already to the canoe. She over there. You gotta set right here. They definitely been here, bastards. Definitely been right here. My trap is sealed it in now. Look at that. I went from all the waves last night. We'll get them. <clears throat> I definitely some tracks here. Probably just missed him some bitch. I need to fence him off a little, it looks like. So close, yet so far. Well, my caster mount has been pulverized and I don't see my trap. Man, they pulverized it. If you remember, when I came up in here yesterday, I made a big mound. Look at all the footprints. Well, we'll see if we got them, but it looks like we should. And I know there's plenty of big pile already on here, so I'm gonna leave it just like it is. Get this slicked up again. Oh, I can smell it. Still smell it. We got their attention, fellas. I'll pull up the drowner here in a second. And we'll see what we got. I want to get it built, rebuilt. It looked like they were starting to build a caster file here. So we just added to it. Made it our own. Oh, that's some good ground there. As of right now, I don't feel anything. I got something. Yeah, I definitely got something. There he is. Oh man, me and these toe catches. <laughs> First night, he couldn't resist it. <clears throat> That's a pretty good sized beaver too. Hell yeah. Man, we about had a double here. He was all over that caster mound. Whew. 
Well, now the fun begins. Gotta carry him out. Holds him by the toes. Get it back in there. In the ground, good. Right there. Okay. Take a pile of seaweed shit right here. Put it on top of that. Kind of disguise it. Usually don't worry about it too much, but I figure might as well make it as covert as possible. Okay, trap right there. Perfect. Well, not quite. I must have stepped right there and pushed it down just a hair. I want it flat. All right. Get this big boy. It's a big beaver. Big guy to the canoe and the work begins. All right, stay tuned guys. We're on the water again. Cruising back. Got one more trap here to check. I'm gonna have to pull Beaver Creek, I think. The sign here is just way, way better than Beaver Creek. Beaver Creek's just so easy to check. This is uh this one's gonna take some effort every day. Um, I don't know, I might like, if I don't get a sneak boat, I might hurry up and get me a 10 foot with a, with a gas motor. And then I can just shoot around down here. And we'll see, lots of options. I'm kind of liking the sneak boats cause I want to be able to do some fishing in, in small ponds and stuff, so. It's really nice out. It's pretty near 70 degrees. The wind's blowing the other direction this time, so it's taking me back to where I need to go. Oh, so much better. Well, there's my beaver. Here's the meat. I'm gonna do a catch and cook. And I wanna eat a tail. Anybody ever eat a tail? I really think about skinning one and eating it. Let me know how, what you think. All right, stay tuned guys. Welcome back. 
we're gonna get the get her all on the grill. And we're gonna bake potato in the oven. Whoops, I just held you guys up in the sky. Don't know camera person. Yes, it is. Marinated and ready to go. Been marinating in the Italian dressing in my uh Oh my god, fajita seasoning? I don't know why I couldn't think of it all of a sudden. I'm gonna put you up on my head here. Get ready for a giveaway. Get that out of the way. So, stay tuned. Let's get this on the grill. Had her heated up pretty good. Or a king, I say. I'm not too particular about my baked potato. A little butter. Couldn't find any sour cream. Sucker, who don't like bacon? You know, I'm gonna freak some people out, but I'm gonna put a little bit more butter on that sucker. I don't want to, but <laughs> there we go. Now I'm good. Okay, now we're just waiting for the back straps to be done, and we're good to go. I'm thinking I probably should tenderize it next time. Beat the hell out of it. All right, I'm going with it. And the grill's being a real piece of crap. How does that look? She's rare. Rare dog for sure. Alright. Since I do everything in POV shots anyways, you might as well just keep going that way. I have knife. Yeah, like I guess that knife will work. I should have cleaned the gristle up a little better. It's a little pink. 
It's already red meat though. Hmm. It's actually pretty good. I'm gonna switch the cameras over to here so that you can see and I gotta get some pictures. Well, I've done near ate everything. <laughs> I didn't even hit record. <laughs> oh man, how stupid. Wow. I've literally been sitting here talking to you guys and eating for what seemed like forever. Look, <laughs> this is all that's left. And uh, I just looked up and happened to see this. I didn't hit record like a freaking idiot. I appreciate everybody that's here, everybody that watches. Uh, share this out, hit the like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. And let me know what you guys want to see. I'm going to be doing a bunch of catch and cooks. I got Spoonbill catch and cook coming up. Never in a million years I think I'd be sitting here eating beaver and with all of you guys. <laughs> my wa my wife watches all these weird food uh, eating videos where they chomp on it really loud and all that stuff. I she might be interested in this. My dog's whining. He could probably smell the beaver too. Get a little red. That's so damn good. The goal originally was to use all the beavers. I have a whole bunch in the freezer to use them for bait, but definitely gonna have to keep the back straps for myself and use the rest for bait. So, unreal. I can't believe all the beavers that I could have been eating all this time. I'm a little worried about that silver meat, but I trimmed a lot of it off. I mean, I this, I really think this turned out a hundred times better than I ever could imagine. Okay, everybody, um, make sure you share this out, hit the thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already. It's going to be it for this video. Definitely more beaver cooks coming. Thinking about grinding some in a hamburger, and I'll have hamburgers one day. I'm very impressed with how good it was. So, as soon as I get the spoon bill, I'm going spoon bill snagging. I'll do a, a video eating that. We're planning on having like a big... Like, like frog legs, everything. So, be watching for that video. Like always, stay tuned.